Just keep chuffing, just keep ch- Oh, hi there boys and girls. I'm Thomas and this is my best friend Percy. Hello, today is our first Leap Pad book review. And today it's Finding Nemo. I love Finding Nemo. Don't you, Percy? I do too. Let's read the story. So all we have to do is press the switch and it works. Finding Nemo. You can always adjust the volume by pressing the up the or down arrows. With your pen. But I normally like it loud. Oh, Percy. Each time. Disney, Pixar, Finding Nemo. Come on, let's go. Sydney, Australia. Australia, the Great Barrier Reef. I'd love to swim in the barrier reef sometime. You can't do that, Thomas. You're a cheeky Seaweed. little tank engine. Okay. Permit crab. Borrows empty shells for protection. I never knew they can do that. Sea urchin. Oh, I've heard of sea urchins. They can spike you up real Has good. Prickly spines for protection. Keep in mind, they're poisonous. Yep, even Mr. Ray says so. Octopus. Squirts black ink when it is scared. Oh boy. Barracuda. Not the barracuda. Anything but that. Has razor sharp teeth. Razor sharp teeth. Squid? Squid. Moves like a jet by shooting out water. Hope he doesn't shoot water at me. Brain coral. Made of millions of tiny animals. Wow. Keep in mind, they're poisonous. Whoa. Antler coral. Made of millions of tiny animals. Keep in mind, they're poisonous. Sea fang Every coral. single coral seems to be poisonous. Made of millions of tiny animals. Keep in mind, they're poisonous. Sea anemone. An animal that looks like a flower. Keep in mind, they're poisonous. Butterfly fish. Travel in schools or groups for safety. Seahorse. <laughs> a fish covered with armored plates. Starfish. Ooh. Can regrow an arm that has been cut off. That's smart. Spanish dancer. <laughs> has skills that look like a dancer's dress. Seagrass. <laughs> Bleached coral. Coral. Turns white when it is not alive. Oh. Are you sure you want to go to school this year? It's time for school! Come on, Dad! Marlin and his son Nemo headed out of the sea anemone home into the great big ocean. Marlin had finally agreed to let Nemo start school. Still, Marlin was worried. The ocean was dangerous and Nemo had a lucky fin that made him a slow swimmer. What if something happened? Are you sure you want to go to school this year? It's time the for fact controller often worries Come about on, me Dad. if I do something dangerous. Oh, we can learn more. Oh, so many creatures in the sea. I'll try to be brief. Welcome to a place of wonder, the Great Barrier Reef. Say it. Touch a word to hear it spoken. Nemo. 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 Spell it. Touch a word to hear it spelled. M A R L I N. Marlin. Yeah. Oh boy. Nemo's going to school. Bubbly boilers. At school, Nemo joined the other students and his new teacher, Mr. Ray. Dad, you can go now. Nemo whispered. Welcome aboard, explorers! shouted Mr. Ray. Marlin was calm until he heard where the class was going. The drop-off. The drop-off! Nemo! No! Exactly what I was thinking. Let's hear what Mr. Ray has to say of it all. Welcome aboard, explorers! Don't worry, my tail is not a stinger! Thank goodness isn't a stinger. Oh! Ah, Manta Ray has no bones, he's cartilage through and through. Now find another creature who is boneless too! Hmm... I might get a bit rusty sometimes. 
What is it, Percy? I know. This it's one. That's right. An octopus is boneless. I never knew they were boneless. Well, you just said it, Percy. <laughs> Silly me. Hold it, hold it. No one's squishing your body. Maybe we'll see a shark. Favorite foods. I wonder what favorite foods they have. You better stay with me, Nemo. That look on Nemo's face doesn't want to stay with Marlin at all. Shrimp. Fish. Plankton. I wonder what these columns do. <laughs> I've got a joke for you, Thomas. What is it, Percy? Why did the fish blush? Why? Because it saw the seaweed. Ah! <laughs> well done, Percy. That was a really good joke. Hello, Thomas and Percy. Can I join in? Of course you can, James. It's free of charge. That means you can enjoy the story of how a little clownfish got lost in the big ocean. <gasps> it can't be Nemo, can't it? I'm afraid it is. Wait until the end of the story. Okay. Must take my place then. <sighs> My tail is not a stinger! Oh, I'm relieved it's not a stinger. Wait, are you a stingray? I don't think he's a stingray, James. My name is Sheldon. I'm H2O intolerant. Uh, uh, two. Bust my buffers! How can a seahorse be H2O intolerant? That's just... I, I don't know what to say. Well, I think it's rather unusual, if you ask me. I agree, James. And rather... Um... Now, what was the word I was looking for? <gasps> that was it! Funny! Um... Percy? Yes, Thomas? I don't think I'd call that funny, would you? I don't think so either. Well, I think it's funny. Ah, uh, that's just your opinion, James. Moving on. What an interesting talent! The drop off! Nemo! No! I agree. Who is this pompous looking butterfly fish? I bet he's gonna become a friend of mine. Hey, I'm Chad! I'm a nauseous! Well, that's great, shall I? Uh, 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 is it me, or does Mr. Ray sound like he's having somewhat of a seizure? another creature who is boneless too. Well, you're the only one I could think of. That's right. A manta ray is boneless. Oh, he's a manta ray. Thank goodness he's not a stingray. Oh, I somehow knew that. Are we there yet? Mom Oliver, you're squishing me. I told you the second time. Nobody's squishing you, my pal. My dad says if you fall into the drop off, you'll never come back. Yikes. Nuh uh. Yo uh huh. Okay, here we go. Next stop, knowledge. Where's knowledge? I've never been there before. Dad, you can go now. Moving on to the story. Marlin raced after Nemo. You don't let me do anything! Nemo cried. Nemo swam towards a boat to prove that he was brave. Suddenly, a scuba diver snatched up Nemo. Marlin wanted to rescue him. Flash! Another scuba diver took Marlin's picture. I'm coming, Nemo! Ah, I can't see! 
no wonder, because you're blinded by a scuba diver taking your picture. Ha ha ha. Shush. Is the story read to you? It's not funny. Touch the speech bubble. Keep swimming, Nemo. Don't look back. Swim, Nemo, swim. Daddy. Don't look back. Don't look back. Don't look, don't look, don't look back. Now it sounds like Darth Vader. It's a scuba diver, not Darth Vader. Hello, you three. Can I join in story time? Why, of course you can, Henry. You're invited for free. Now, come over here and take a spot right next to me. Oh, field trips in the ocean. We must act like a troop. Buddy up, have some fun, but always stay with the group. Moving on to the next page. Oh, I've fallen! Cranky will grab you. Marlon yelled. He swam after the boat, but he could not catch up with it. Has anybody seen a boat? Marlon asked. Luckily, someone had. A forgetful fish mm. named Dory. Together, they set off to find Nemo. Hmm. Camouflage, camouflage, where are you? Creatures hide by matching backgrounds, peek a boo! <laughs> ah! An octopus can change colors to hide. Wow. A seahorse can change colors to hide. Double wow. Eels can eat fish. Find the yellow fish. <laughs> fish can eat crabs. Find the red crab. Crabs can eat plants. Find the purple plant. Food chain. Food chain. Food chain. Food, food, food chain. Touch the sun to learn about the food chain. The sun gives energy to plants so they can make their own food. Find the purple plant. Plants can be eaten by crabs. Find the red crab. Crabs can be eaten by fish. Find the yellow fish. Fish can be eaten by eels. Find the orange eel. That's a food chain. Starfish. Eel. Cuttlefish. Kelpfish. Angel shark. Crab. <laughs> the flounder looks like sand on the ocean floor. So I can see. The flatfish looks like sand on the ocean floor. Nemo! No, please, no! He's gone. The boat. Nemo. Hi, I'm Dory. I've seen a boat. It went this way. Follow me. Hurt her last fish. Nemo had to escape. 
Welcome to the tank, my young friend. I'm Gil. That's Bubbles. And he really likes Bubbles. Hence his name. <laughs> Don't worry, little guy. I may blow up sometimes. <gasps> little help! That's Deb and her sister Flo. Hi, honey. I'm Peach. Did you come from the pet store? Bonjour! I am Jacques, a crustacean who loves to clean. Voila! That is Gurgle, a fish that appreciates a fine cleaning. Clean is my game. You always say that, don't you, James? I want to go home. What is that thing? Behold! Mount Wanahakalugi! Mount Wanahakalugi? I want to go home! I want to go home! Okay, so let's see what's on the next page. Back in the ocean, Marlin and Dory kept searching. They swam deeper into the dark ocean. Just keep swimming, Dory Just keep said cheerily. Swimming. Finally, Dory and Marlin made it back towards the surface. They met a school of moonfish who pointed them in the right direction. Sydney, Australia. Yay! Just keep swimming. Just keep swimming. Oh, let me try. Just, Just keep, keep swimming. swimming. Just, Just keep, keep swimming. swimming. Me too! Just keep swimming! Just keep swimming! Let us try, please! Sure you can, Thomas and Percy! Just keep swimming! Just keep swimming! I can't see! I don't know where I'm going! Well, I'm sure you know what to do! Just keep swimming! Just keep swimming! Whoa! Something's just bit me! Whoa! Where did that ball come from? What is that thing? Anglerfish! Oh, I've heard of anglerfish, alright. They're really dangerous creatures. Ouch! Hey, no poking! No one's poking you, Dory. You're right there. Watch it! Yep, the deep sea is full of rather odd noises. An anglerfish has teeth in its throat, so prey can't escape. A gulper eel swallows fish bigger than itself. What in the world? A viper fish has razor sharp teeth. A giant squid can weigh as much as a car. Oh, we don't weigh as much as trains. Tube worms can grow to be two and a half meters tall. Whoa. Jellyfish. Boing. That's the bell or body of a jellyfish. <laughs> the tentacles give off poison. Boing. Boing. In fact, they boing. poison yourself. Boing. 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 So the pink boing. ones boing, boing. while the purple boing. ones do music. Boing. 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 Fish. Without a heart, bones, 
your brain. It's made almost entirely of water, but can give you a great big pain. Tentacles. Help animals grab, feel, or sting. Find some. Say it. Tops. Spell it. Spell it. T. T. Say it. Tentacles. Help animals grab, feel, or sting. Find some. That's right. Those are jellyfish tentacles. They are so dangerous. Whoa! The East Australian current! Corey and Marlin made it through the jellyfish. A bale of sea turtles saw their brave escape and wanted to help. Crash and his friends showed them how to ride the East Australian current. Get grab shell, dude! Crash said. I remember his fancy talk. Noggin! Dude, name's Crush. You want the EAC? You're riding it! I need to get to the East Australian current. Dude, I'm Squirt. Hey, look, turtles! Woohoo! Female sea turtles lay up to 200 eggs at one time. <gasps> they can't do. Sea turtles can hold their breath up to five hours. But no way! Sea turtles can live to be 150 years old. Man, that's a lot of years. Sea, tur sea turtles have a hard shell. Newborn sea turtles use ocean currents to help them travel. Sea turtles have been around for over 200 million years. My oh my. Whoa, that's one funky current, dude. Percy, give me some buffer. <laughs> Noggin. That's one funky sound that turtle just made. Oh, a female turtle will travel far, hundreds of miles each way, to lay her eggs on the same old beach where she had her first birthday. Oh boy, this is Nemo's escape. I remember. When Marlon and Dory finally reached Nemo, Dala had already arrived. Marlon thought he had lost his son. Just then, Gil shot out of the tank and landed on the dentist's mirror. Nemo flew through the air and down the sink. Nemo escaped. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. What number is Thomas? One. What number is Henry? Three. What number is James? Five. What number is Percy? Six. One, three. <gasps> this is awful. Help me, help me.
for Nemo, the bravest clownfish in the Great Barrier Reef. Nemo made it through the sink and into the harbour. Did I miss anything? Story. She Edward, find his father. you're in the end of the story. Nemo and Marlon oh, were together sorry. again. Back safely on the reef, Marlon and Nemo shared their adventures with all of their friends. That crab just made a rather weird noise. Bubbles! You know my father? It's you! You're Nemo! I found you! Nemo's gone. <laughs> Made me ink. <laughs> Anglerfish are dangerous. Hey, kids! My dad is the bravest fish in the ocean. Nemo's back. I'm from the EAC, dude. Mr. Clownfish, did all that stuff really happen? Hi, Marlin. <laughs> it's a good thing Nemo's back with his best friends. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Well, hello, Nemo. My dad is the bravest fish in the ocean. So many cool animals in the deep blue sea. There's turtles and anglerfish and jellyfish to see. We learned so much on our ocean journey. Let's play, Let's a, play game. a game. For show and tell today, please welcome... Gordon! Marlin! Oh. Hey, kids! Mr. Clownfish, did all that stuff really happen? Help decide what really happened on Marlin's journey. Nemo escaped by swimming down the dentist's sink. Oh, that's that an true? easy one. Nice work. Here's another one. A trail of chocolate chips leads to the harbour. I don't think well so. Well done! What leads to the harbour? Touch a picture to decide. The sink! The dentist's sink. Nice work. Here's another one. A banana has scary teeth and a glowing light. Is that true? <coughs> well That's done! Not what true. has scary teeth and a glowing light? Touch mm. a picture to decide. <laughs> Dory oh, and it's an fish. Nice work. Hey, great show and tell learning. To play again, Legends Forever at the bottom of the page. No problem. That was great. Truth or false. We love to visiting the, the Great Barrier Reef. Up and down arrows. Okay. So that's all from Gordon Edward. Thomas, Percy, James, and Henry from the Steam Team. In Chapter 2 is Game Time. We're going to be playing all the games featured in this book. Bye! <laughs>